Hey guys, Blue Rabbit here, and today I am unboxing my, uh, what month is this? <laughs> April? My April haul. Um, this is probably going to be into two parts as well, just because I have stuff coming in at different times of the month. Um, some of these I actually ordered in March, but I thought I would just include into my April haul, just because it arrived, you know, pretty far into April. Alright, so here we go. Uh, I have quite a lot of stuff um, from different places. So let's just start off with this one. Okay, so here we go. This one is from uh, Tokyo Taku Mode, I believe. I'm actually surprised they did not send me their like um, their proprietary box, which has like their name um, on it. So it's actually quite interesting to me. Every month I keep telling myself to slow down on um, collecting, but every month it doesn't happen. God, I'm so bad at self-control. Anyways, look at that. That's kind of, can you see that? It's like a face. <laughs> kind of scared me for a second there. But uh, this is their new card. That's really nice looking. Wow, I kind of like that. So I am a huge fan of um, like white haired characters, I guess. I think it's really nice. And here it is on the inside is my packing slip, which I won't show because it has your address on it. And of course, their little ninja sticker. Um, that's actually all that's in there, but that's really cool. Now I have a, another little mini clear file to put up on my wall. Okay, and what I actually got, it's a, another, um, it's another Nendroid that I actually already own. So this is number 594, Yagen Toshiro from the online game Token Nambu Online. Yes, I already actually do own this Nendroid, but I thought I would order another one because, um, like I said, I have really bad uh, impulse control when buying um, items, but not only that, but because Yagen is actually like my third favorite character from the series, and for my Nendroids, I thought I would collect two of the ones that I like. Um, like I really like that are like my favorites, so I only own two of Yagen, I own two of Hotaru Maru, and I own two of Shokudai Kirimitsu Tada, because those are my three top three favorites of the game. So yeah, so there is him. And this second box is actually from um, kind of a random store just because I decided to buy this Nandroid quite late and he was sold out everywhere else. So the price is a little bit higher than I would pay per Nandroid to be honest, but um, I have a feeling he's probably going to get re-released and then I'll be kicking myself for buying him so expensively, but um, I don't know, I, I thought I would pick him up just in case that re-release never really comes, although Good Smile has been pretty good about their re-releases lately, so oh well. So um, I picked him up from this shop called Enite Media. Um, they, they are a legitimate website, they ship from the US, um, free shipping over anything that's like $40. Anyways, here's the one I picked up. So here's, oh, oh god, <laughs> I did not expect that. Styrofoam pieces like that, okay. Ooh, lovely. But I do like that they like protected it in this way. So. If you can't tell, this is number Nendroid number 657, Dazai Osama, from the anime Bungo Stray Dogs. I believe it's also a manga? I'm not sure. And then we just slide this little protective cover on. And what's kind of awesome about it is that, so this is their first Nendroid uh, that Good Smile made in their Japanese, um, oh, warehouse, in their Japanese um, manufacturing plant kind of thing that's located inside Japan and not China, so they kind of made their box a little bit different. Sorry for all the glare. Because that plastic window is bigger, it makes it pick up the glare all the more. But here is Dazai, and here is the back part. So like I said, I picked him up a little bit late, so I did not pick him up from my usual places, but that's okay. I still was able to get him. A little bit more expensive though, but he is quite sold out in other shops. Okay, and the next few items that I have in this packaging is actually from my normal um, uh, proxy service that I use called Zen Market. And if you guys um, want to know what about more about Zen Market, I'll include the little review I did um, in the iCard 
link. Alright, so the reason, so as you guys can probably tell, it's a long tube thing, and that is because... Okay, and that is because I ordered a tapestry, a pretty big tapestry from the looks of it, or a long tapestry from the looks of it, so... But look at that, like they wrap, I always love the way that they wrap their items. My items usually never or ever arrive damaged. <sighs> okay, so here is what I got. I've been waiting for this one for quite a while. So this is actually a tapestry of um, Akashi from Kuroko no Basket, who is my favorite character. This is the Coffee Break version. So I'm actually really excited to... Okay. Woo! Yes! Ah! Oh my god! Oh! It's so much bigger than I thought it would be! Oh, it looks so nice! Oh, I really like it. So this is it. Um, I'm a big fan of Akashi and I'm a really big sucker for him in like more casual outfits and stuff so when I saw that this went up on sale I just I had to pick him up. Um, I believe it was exclusive to uh, Animate? I'm not really sure but yeah. Oh, God, I could just stare at it all day. Oh, it feels so good. Okay, sorry. <laughs> I'm getting so distracted. Okay, and then we have one final box um, for now. Um, oh, it's actually a lot heavier than I thought it would be, which is pretty cool. All right, and this is also from Zen Market, so this is the rest of the order that I was expecting to ship with that tapestry, but I did not expect that tapestry to be so, so big, so. <laughs> so that's why that one was shipped separately to me. Surprisingly, this time, my packages, I normally send them the cheapest shipping, which is um, surface airlift or sal small packet, but and they usually take two weeks um, to arrive, which is, you know, normal, I guess, but it was really surprising to me that this came super quickly. I think it only took me like, it only took like a week. Either that, I was just really busy, and I didn't notice. <laughs> So this is, like I said, it's from Zen Market as usual, so there's that sign. And, oh god, they, as always, they do a really good job packaging to make sure things are safe. Okay, and here is the card that they usually send that just says thank you in a lot of different uh, languages. Alright, so, like I said, they usually do a pretty good job packing uh, their items. So, let's see if I can get this in the shots. Alright, so, um... Oh, I was really confused with some of these things in here. Okay, so little bubbly things, which is really cool. I like it when shops use this, they're really light. Oh god, there's just so much stuff in here! Ah, okay. Um... Alright, so first I'll start off with this thing. Which, as expected, is a lot thinner than I knew it would be. Um, so, in my other videos, I was saying how uh, lately I've been into <laughs> uh, Katsukyo Hitman Reborn, or Home Tutor Reborn, and um, I, for, I've been debating on getting this one for a while, but um, his stuff is always really expensive on the aftermarket, so I just, I was like, okay, whatever. I picked him up. Like I said, low impulse control. Okay, and that is this pillow. So, Hibari Kyoya from Katekeshi Hitman Reborn. Um, yeah, it's a pillow. To be honest, um, for those of you out there who also like plan on getting pillows, um, they're quite, uh, at least the ones that I see from um, Animate and like Movic, um, like exclusive to their stores, they're quite thin. Um, this one's vacuum formed, or vacuum sealed, so that's why it's so thin. But I can already tell that there's not a lot of um, cushion, like stuffing in, in him, uh, in, in the pillow in the first place. So for those of you who like want to consider buying pillows, like you should be aware that um, they usually aren't very thick, so I don't think they're meant to be slept on. They're, I think they're just meant for like decorative purposes because they're very thin. Um, 
but I was drawn in by the picture, so I just figured I'll pick up this one and probably stop buying any more merch for him unless I can find it very cheaply or something. So, <laughs> look at that. My two husbandos side by side, you know. Okay. And here is the next thing I got. So these, these are Haikyuu rubber straps. Um, a rubber strap set. Uh, exclusive to animate as well. Ooh, and I believe it comes with a bonus. So that's nice, because I definitely did not order this thing. I can um, get it to open up. There we go. So let's start off with the bonus here. <laughs> oh, that's really cool. So this is from Boku no Hero Academia. And Todoroki, I don't really know what these are. They look like um, like coasters or something like that. That's really cool if I can get this to open. So I definitely did not normally come with this because this is high cute. So anyways, here goes. I'll just go through it real quick. Awesome bonus. Okay. And my battery's running out, so I'm gonna try and go through the rest of these real quick. So these are cute little Haikyuu rubber straps uh, of the Nitotan um, looks. I really love the looks from this. If we have time, I'll open this at the very end. Alright, next and the final thing we have in this box, and it's now empty, is um, so these are some uh, Uta no Prince Sama clear file of uh, my favorite characters uh, in, that I won in lots. Um, one set was from uh, Yahoo Auctions, and the other set was from this um, mobile uh, selling place called uh, Otam Otamart, I think it's called Otamart. I bought this, these two lots of um, Utano Prince Sama clear file items because I've been searching for these for a while actually, and it, they came up at a really great price. So I'll just go through them really quick individually. comment and don't forget to subscribe if you already haven't and I guess that's really it <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching until next time bye bye